Hi, I am Dr. Vikram GD, Senior Consultant, Urologist and Andologist, Manipal Hospitals, Hebban and Ashanpur. I am here to talk about prostate and the surgery done for the prostate. I specialize in laser surgeries and neurology, one of which is lasers used in the prostate called HOLEP or otherwise holmium enucleation of the prostate. To briefly talk about this prostate gland, prostate gland is an accessory sex gland which is there only in men and it enlarges with age, what we call an aging disease. Why this is important? This gland is right below the urinary bladder encircling the water pipe of the urinary bladder. So with age due to multifactorial there is various reasons, one of them being the hormonal changes in the body, this tends to enlarge thereby compressing the water pipe or what we call urethra and causing obstructive urinary symptoms. The symptoms can be broadly categorized as obstructive as irritative which includes uh, hesitancy to pass urine, passing thin stream of urine, straining to pass urine or even a feeling of incomplete voiding. The other symptoms is categorized as irritative symptoms which will be urgency to go frequently to the urination and nocturia that is waking up many times in the night is considered nocturia and about two to three times is considered abnormal. This prostate problem can be essentially treated with medicines and surgery. Earlier the gold standard surgery for prostate was what we call trans resection of the prostate which was an endoscopic surgery done to remove the prostate by cutting it into small pieces using current. With the advent of new lasers in urology, we have come up with a technique called as HOLEP which is expanded as Holmium enucleation of the prostate. Now how this procedure has revolutionized the whole treatment of prostate is this procedure can be safely used. It is again a non-invasive endoscopic procedure so basically there is no cut on the body. The energy used to cut the prostate is different, a technique is different. In this technique, we scoop out large chunks of prostate meat and push it into the bladder then churn it out into small pieces by a process known as morselation and suck it out. So the main advantage of this procedure as compared to the conventional uh, TURP is this can be done in large prostates with minimal complications. And also the main big advantage of this procedure is this can be safely done in patients who are on blood thinners. As we see most of our patients are in the age group of 60 and above and many of the occasions they are having other comorbidities such as diabetes, hypertension and heart issues and invariably they are on some blood thinners. Whereas in uh, gold standard procedures like TURP we had to st stop the uh, medication before doing the procedure they were compromising the safety of uh, heart problems but in this without stopping we can safely do because laser is far more superior in controlling the bleeding as compared to uh, the other conventional procedures. So at the end of this, what does this yield? This procedure thereby advantages, we can do big procedures, lesser bleeding, in the, it translates into lesser complications in post-op patients, minimizing their hospital stay, less risk of bleeding and far better results as compared to the conventional procedure. So any patient who is suffering from urinary symptoms such as difficulty in passing urine, poor stream or waking up very frequently, they have to consult your nearest urologist and also I want to make that this availability of a new uh, laser procedure which can be safely done and far more effective than the conventional procedures and it is very beneficial to our patients. Thank you.